All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, or I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And it's a shit, Shalom, to all the Akim out here that's doing again, putting work in truth and in sincerity. Okay, we're going this video from this article from um, RT. Okay, and um, it says the EU is gravely concerned about U.S. sanctioning ICC officials investigating its troops urges D.C. to reverse its decision. Okay. It says the European Union has called on Washington to reverse its unacceptable and unprecedented sanctions of international criminal court. It says the ICC officials who are investigating U.S. troops for potential war crimes. Okay. And President Trump authorized economic and travel sanctions against ICC employees who are looking into potential U.S. war crimes in Afghanistan last week. The EU expressed grave concern about the U.S. move in a statement which urged Washington to reverse its decision. The bloc also reaffirmed its unwavering support for the ICC. It says the, the EU said it remains committed to defending the ICC from any outside interference aimed at obstructing the court of justice and undermining the international system of criminal justice. It also committed a uh, comment on what it described as increasing pressure facing rules based international order likely in reference to the U.S. withdrawal from international agreements like the Paris Accord and the uh, Iran nuclear deal along with the Human Rights Council. Okay. The ICC probe is largely focused on the actions of the Taliban and Afghan security forces, but is also looking into allegations of U.S. personnel abusing prisoners in black sites in Af Afghanistan, Lithuania, Poland, and Romania. Announcing the sanctions last week, Secretary of State Mike Pompeo urged more countries to join the U.S. in pushing back against the ICC, warning that other nations could be next in the, in the court sites, particularly NATO members who fought terrorism in Afghanistan right alongside of us. This didn't appear to have the desired effect as NATO members, France and the Netherlands, said they were dismayed and very disturbed by news of the U.S. move. Okay. First off, when, uh, you know, get this uh, scripture. This is Job 9 and 24. And it says, The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covers the faces of the judges thereof. Okay. If not, where and who is he? Okay. And, um, you know, we use this scripture as a, you know, fact to say that, you know, they are, um, you know, that they changed the image of the Most High uh, in uh, his son, you know, to a so-called white man. Okay. But, you know, this scripture, I'm going to apply to this uh, lesson, man, okay, because, um, you know, they're being uh, uh, investigated for their war crimes, you know, and they're trying to cover, you know, up, you know, what the, um, the, the, the people that are trying to, uh, you know, investigate them, they're trying to cover them up, you know, so that nobody can uh, see, you know, what, what they're doing. You know, if you if you investigate them from off, of, and if here go the thing, if they didn't do anything wrong, you know, 
then it would be it would be uh okay. You know? You wouldn't have nothing to hide. But the truth is that, you know, they must have done something or they must do things, you know, that um <clears throat> you know, that they're uh they don't want to get out there, okay? They don't want they don't want the truth to 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 be brought into the light. Okay? Um which John 3 and 20 says for everyone that does evil hates the light. You know, cuz they don't want they don't want the, the the world to know what uh what they have done, you know, behind closed doors. Okay? It says neither comes to the light lest his deeds should be reproved. You know? And a lot of these countries, man, they don't they don't they the Lord the Lord said that he's going to make it to where you know this this third world war is going to happen, man. Okay? And it's going to come uh quickly, man. Okay? Um This is Revelation 17 and 16. It says, "And the 10 horns which thou sawest upon the beast, these shall hate the whore, which the whore is uh, America or Babylon the Great. It says, and shall make her desolate and naked and so shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire. Okay. So these uh, nations, man, you know, this prophecy is, is about to come to pass, man. You know, because these nations, they, they, it, <laughs> as you, you've seen in the article, you know, that uh, France and the Netherlands, you know, uh, the, the U.S. was calling out to them, you know, to the people who fought alongside the, the U.S., you know, to, 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 you know, get alongside, get along with the, the moves that they're doing, you know, but. You know their their friends who who went along with them. They said that they they're very disturbed by you know the moves that they um have uh, done. Then it says it's unacceptable interference and in rule of law. Okay. So this world this war man is about to to, to go down man. Okay. Isaiah, is it nine and uh, five? For every battle of the warrior is with confused noise and garments rolled in blood, but this shall be with burning and fuel of fire. Okay? So, America, man, you know, they got a lot uh, coming towards them, man. Okay? Because the Lord is about to judge America, okay. Um, Babylon the Great, Isaiah forty-seven and one. It says, "Come down and sit in the dust, O virgin daughter of Babylon." Okay, and the dust represents confusion. Okay. Just yesterday, okay, they a lot of these phone services, you know, they said that they suffered the DDoS attack, you know. Uh, 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 you have the race wars, you know, more and more stuff is about to start happening, you know, before our eyes. It says, O oh, virgin daughter of Babylon, it says, sit on the ground, there is no throne, O daughter of the Chaldeans, for thou shalt no more be called tender and delicate, Okay. And that's what's going on. It says, take the millstone and grind mill, uncover thy locks, make bare the leg, uncover the thigh, pass up over the rivers. It says, thy nakedness shall be uncovered. Yeah, thy shame shall be seen. Okay, and it could very well be, you know, that uh, a lot of the stuff that they, what you know, was they're bringing it to... Uh, to pass about uh which is is no um it's no secret 
you know, that they, you know, raped, robbed, and murdered, you know, for this land. This land was built on stolen land, okay? Which a lot of these nations, you know, that um, in the, the in EU and all that stuff, they, they are par, part of it, okay? But, um, you know, their, their history, man, and, and the history of lies and stuff like that, you know, and covering up those lies has been, you know, but you know, to the light about what they actually, uh, you know, have done to our people, you know? And then uh, the stuff that they're doing to this day is all being brought, you know, to the forefront, okay? It says, I will take vengeance and I will not meet you as a man because guess what? The Lord, the one who the world ignorantly calls Jesus, Okay, it's going to come back. Okay, and he's going to be the one that set the record straight. Okay? <laughs> as much as people don't want to, uh, you know, admit, man, you know. Uh, so it says, uh, as for our Redeemer, the Lord of hosts is his name, the Holy One of Israel. It says, sit thou silent and get thee into darkness, O daughter of the Chaldeans, for thou shalt no more be called the lady of kingdoms. I was wroth with my people. I have polluted mine inheritance and given them into your hand. Thou didst sow them no mercy. Okay? Upon the ancient hast thou very heavily laid thy yoke. Okay? And, um, you know, our people have, haven't been sold mercy, man. You know, a person um, that, uh, you know, like a lot of people are, uh, they're they, they talking about this um, accident or this, this shooting, this killing that happened in um, Atlanta. You know, the cops tried to lock the guy up, which is not uh, illegal to be drunk, you know, but they tried to lock him up and say that, you know, he wasn't able to, to drive or whatever the case may be, you know. Could have just told him, hey, get a, you know, Uber and then come back, you know. But, you know, they wanted to lock him up and, you know, the guy was scared for his life. And, you know, he ran and, you know, the <laughs> the story goes from there, you know. He took the taser and, you know, he had, which he, you know, was stupid, you know. But at the end of the day, all the killings and stuff like that, that, these cops have have done you know they they aren't showing our people any mercy mercy um there are a lot of um you know hangings okay and they're trying to say that a lot of them are um uh, uh suicides and stuff like that you know so it says and thou saidst i shall be a lady forever so that thou didst not lay these things to thy heart Neither didst remember the latter end of it. Okay. Therefore, hear now this, thou that art given to pleasures that dwell carelessly, dwellest carelessly, that says in thine heart, I am and none else beside me. I shall not sit a widow, neither shall I know the loss of children. But these two things shall come to you in a moment and one day the loss of children and widowhood they shall come upon you and the perfection for the multitude of thy sorceries and for the abundance for the great abundance of your enchantments okay and uh you know they totally enchanted you know our people man you know got them thinking that this is all there is you know, put our people under, you know, that Babylonian spell, you know, uh, uh, what is it? Uh, it's called Stockholm syndrome, you know? So our people, you know, the, those people that fall under that guise, you know, are going to, um, you know, be destroyed with that guise also. Okay. So, you know, the Lord is about to, um, Bring some real uh, judgment, you know, on this place, man. Okay. It says, for thou hast trusted in thy wickedness. Thou hast said, none seeth me. 
okay? And that's what's going on. They're being investigated for these war crimes, okay? These They would never be investigated for these slavery crimes because a lot of these nations, you know, they was in on it, okay? It says, thy wisdom and thy knowledge, it has perverted thee, and thou hast said in thine heart, I am and none else beside me. Because America, they believe that they are, they are a god and that they don't have to move according to the rules of the world, okay? So, next verse, it says, Therefore shall evil come upon you, thou shalt not know from whence it rises. And mischief shall fall upon you, thou shalt not be able to put it off. Okay, and desolation shall come upon you suddenly, which thou shalt not know. Okay, so the Lord is about to bring those chariots. Okay, these these wars here on this land and the wars from the other countries. Okay, are about to come. Okay, it's going to be a lot of you know uh, uh, confusion in this place, man. Okay, similar to. Uh, when the Lord brought that confusion upon Egypt, because America is modern day Egypt, you know, it's, and, and Babylon means confusion in the first place. OK, so it's going to be the greatest confusion and, you know, known in history, man, you know. So with that, Lord willing, this was edifying. I want to say a solemn one until next time.